Hello, and welcome to this week's Agronomy Update. I'm Ryan Bates, field agronomist for DuPont Pioneer. Today we're going to discuss top dress and our side dressing applications, and why you may want to consider applying supplemental nitrogen and or sulfur to your current corn crop. In walking fields the past few days, there have been many fields that need some supplemental nutrients. There have been a number of fields showing signs of nitrogen deficiency. In addition, some fields are showing some sulfur deficiency, especially those on sandier or low organic matter soils. The reason we are seeing these deficiencies this year is a result of heavy rains in recent weeks has either leached nitrogen and sulfur below the corn root zone or because the soils have been saturated. When soil sits saturated, nitrogen will go through a process called denitrification where plant available nitrogen is converted to nitrogen unavailable to the plant. Nitrogen deficiency symptoms create a yellow coloration in the V-shaped pattern on the lower leaves. The pattern will progress from the leaf end to the leaf collar and will move from the lower to the upper leaves. This can easily be confused with potassium deficiency, which creates similar symptoms on the lower leaves. However, the yellowing occurs from the leaf margins into the midrib. On the other hand, soft deficiency exhibited on the newer leaves and has intervenous colosis or yellowing stripes on the newer leaves. Now that you know your deficient nutrient, you can adjust your top dressing or side dress plan to supply your corn crop with required nutrients to help achieve high yielding corn. For more information, contact your local DuPont Pioneer sales professional.